we're at, we're gonna continue, and we're gonna start with our interview with Piper. Piper, you ready for that interview now, Blue? Let's do it. All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. W wait, <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? The war? Which war? The one that gave us this lovely landscape of demolished buildings and nuclear radiation every time. Alrighty. Interruption done. Before they blasted it into pieces? Yes. Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The woman out of time. Yes. So you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare the to the woman out life? of time? How do you Can think? Can you even compare the two? The world out here? It's not even close to the one I left. Feeling a little homesick, are we? Can't say I blame you. No. The big question. You came all this way looking for someone. Who is it? A family member. I lost family, okay? I'm trying to get one of them back. What's their name, Blue? Who are they? Sean. My baby Sean was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. The parent after the missing child. As heartbreaking today as it ever was. Tell me, do you suspect the Institute's involved? The Institute? The Institute? Who are they? That blue is the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth. No one really knows who or where they are, but their handiwork is all over. Synths. Synthetic people. Sent from their hidden labs to do the Institute's dirty work. Sometimes they even replace a person with a synth double. A little covert agent no one would ever suspect. Now, not mm. everything that goes wrong has the Institute behind it, but there's always a chance. That's why I'm asking. Mm. They might be. Sure sounds like they might be. Not even a baby is safe from them. <laughs> and people wonder why I can't just look the other way. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? People ignore Wait, this? People just ignore kidnappings out here? <laughs> yeah, Blue. You haven't noticed? You grow up in the Commonwealth and eventually someone is gonna get taken. <laughs> Maybe not someone you know, but someone. And people just say, well, could have been worse. Could have been killed by raider attacks or super mutants or feral ghouls. <laughs> they just give up. So I want my readers to hear what keeps you going. Maybe they'll find a little inspiration. Now, what would you like to say? Don't lose hope. No matter how much you want to give up, don't. You have to have hope that that you'll see them again, or at least that you'll know the truth. A strong note to end on, Blue. Thanks. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway. Mm -hmm. I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Done, and we level up. Yes. Strong back, here I come. Alright. Let's talk to you, Piper. Hey, Piper. Heading my way? You wanna travel with Are you me? sure you wanna travel with me? Well, it's that, or get back to writing the paper. I guess the paper can wait. Hmm. Should I take her now or wait till we get back? Uh. Hello. 
Hello? Anyone home? Let's go. Sure, let's go. We'll do. <laughs> yep, you're going back. Oh, sorry, boy. Time for you to head home. Sanctuary. Alright. Let's put some points in strong bag. Alrighty. Your sister's going with me, alright? Watch your back. The institute could be right behind you. Mm, maybe. Let's get out of here. So now the paper's not gonna get written as long as she's with us, I think. So that's something. It's big, loud, oh no. I think we're having a uh, nuclear storm right now. Alright, let's get out of here. I ain't telling you how to pick your friends. Yeah, gotta go this way. We don't need to go that way just yet. The fans. Well, they can easily be mistaken. Feral ghouls are horrible. Yeah. yeah, these things are very agile and fast and annoying. <laughs> these ghouls. Yeah, haven't really seen that pic, that uh, loading screen model of them yet. So, uh, when this part commences, uh, that'll probably be it for this session. And we will continue the next session another day, perhaps. All speculation. So, we have to head to... Uh, we gotta get past the combat zone. But we gotta go to uh, Park Street Station, if I remember correct. So, let's go. To go out this way. We can go that way. We can go to Looking here. for Diamond City. Just follow the signs. We go that way. That dogs we had to deal with. So I don't really want to deal with them right now. So. Let's go this way. Actually, we had to deal with him anyway. Fair play game. So you get one of the most fancy vault suits. Indeed, I one do. Size fit all. Let's see, our in uh, inventory. Pretty good. So, we're gonna sneak our way through here. And if a dog does mess with us, we will lead him back to the, uh, the minigun back there. One of these dogs do have, uh, they have a legendary weapon on them. But I managed to sleep, sneak by. So we don't have to worry about them for now. Not much we can do about the storm, but weather it out. Pun not intended. <laughs> it's just gonna keep going until it wants to stop. What about the library? Look at this. I like the effects. I'm not gonna be, um, bother with trying to get into that library. Out here, that you can be a shot from anywhere, from up top, down ground level. This is super mutant territory. Most likely. Yep. Wait a minute, I think I didn't even I missed that Trinity. Oh, here it is. Help or Mayday or whatever it is one says on a radio. My name is Rex Goodman. 
I'm being held prisoner on the top of Trinity Tower. I think the super mutants plan on eating me soon. <laughs> I'm setting this to repeat. Ah, oh, shit! Gotta sign off. One of the super mutants is coming. Help or okay. Mayday or whatever it is one says on a radio. Turn it off. We got another quest we can do in the future. Not right now. Alright, let's deal with this guy. Oh crap, I keep getting to deal with this. Done. No. Oh. I wanna talk to you, no. I wanna loot. Okay. Stop, stop, stop. Let's take out this guy. Well, let's not take him out. No, not right now. We're not gonna rescue him right now. At least that storm's over. We're gonna keep going. <laughs> Let's keep moving. That's the thing about traveling through here, in this combat zone. What the? It's a chance you can run into enemies like raiders right here. Damn it. Let my partner worry about him. We're trying to survive right now. Alright, down this way is Combat Zone and Swan. Swan is over there, and Swan is very tough. And I'm not gonna tangle with Swan right now. I'm walking right into Boston Commons. Let's see, grenade. People right. don't come back from here. We have to go through Swan to get uh, let's quit save. And the combat zone is down that way. Boston Common. And uh, Swan is right there. And Swan is very difficult. As you will see when I quick save. I do this. It's not attacking him. Alright, let's uh, use this. This would definitely hit him. This game is difficult. And I'm not gonna sit by and watch him. He will not get us in here. <laughs> uh, oops. Go aid. Put our arrows speed to us. Where is he? 